welcome to Angie's Craft Corner. I'm Angie. Today we are going to do an emboss card with Vossmark ink and embossing powder. I'm using the stamp set that I got from Wish.com. This one, I know I've used it a lot lately, but it's one of my favorite ones because I love this flower one. But it's uh, Thinking of You is the card. And uh, I'm going to kind of do this fasting. Well, maybe not too fast this morning. And then I'm also using uh, the Paper Studio Follow the Color Box of Cards. I got these, and I love the corners of these. And um, you get five of each corner, each design. And this is the one I'm using this morning. So, and I'm putting this out of my way because otherwise I'll have it in my way. So, I'm going to move this out of my way. And sorry, I'll hit the camera. I'm going to... This is just a scrap piece of paper, but I'm using my embossing pillow to clean it. Because I don't want to waste ink. I mean, embossing powder. This way it will all, hopefully, fall back into the jet, the dilly. And I'm going to put this in the semi-center of this. And I'm going to close that up because I don't want any bossing powder blown. And this is a brownish bottle of embossing powder. <clears throat> And I'm going to, while I'm doing this, turn on my heat gun. Croak. If I can find it. And let it warm up. Get that out of my way. Oops. Wait. <coughs> This should be heated. It's heated. And then I'm just going in and melting this. And you can tell, I don't know if you can on camera, but if you're watching it, you can tell when it melts. Ouch. Okay, I'm going to bring in the cutter bug, and I'm going to cut a sample out with this. If I was thinking, I would break. And no, I'm not preparing for this today. And this is the one I cut on. As y'all can tell, I'm going to see how rough it is. Okay, I'm using my A plate, my magnetic plate, and plate B. And I'm going to do two at a time. I'm going to do the 
one I'm going to use for the background also at the same time. To save time. Now, <laughs> some people say don't do it. Me, I'm like, let's save time. I mean, this not even play real. And what I'm doing is, uh, I'm using two different sizes, one bigger one than the other. And yes, it will cut a little bit of the leaves off, but I'm fine with that. And I'm just going to unsandwich it. See how easy that was, y'all? And you get two different sizes. Ah. And I'm going to put these back in my package. Otherwise, I'm like, what's my package? Do my nails like that? I mean, hey, I'm honest. Okay, <sighs> let's see. I'm doing a BT5, DG3, and a CT1 for this. With my Spectrum Nose, uh, oh, if I can open them. And I'm just going to go in and color this. I'm not doing no fancy coloring. I'm just coloring. Uh, I think we are going to be doing a, a little uh, album. A travel album. Since I'm fixing on vacation. And... Uh, See how that goes. And I'm not going to leave y'all hanging. I'm going to have some videos recorded while I'm gone. I'm scheduling videos to post for the ones that's wondering. I've got a busy week ahead of me this week. Or should I say last week because this is, I'm a week ahead right now. Making no videos. Okay, I'm just, like I said, I'm calling this in real quickly, or as quickly as possible. And I'm trying not to hit the embossing 
part of it because I've noticed it discolorizes it a little. Now, I'm not sure why it's doing that because I thought you could pretty well call over that once it's set, heat set, but I guess you can't. I mean, I'll, I did learn something new doing this. <laughs> No, I wasn't sure how I would like the brown, but I like the brown. Okay. I'm going to use art glue glue, as usual. Okay, I'm going to cut this down. To about two inches. I'm trying to get this straight. And I'm using We All uh, Memory Keepers um, trim and scoreboard. And I'm just going to use my art glue glue again to stick this on. And I know that looks like a lot of glue. It's really not. Because that tip I've got on it is so fine. I'm going to trim this off. Now you don't have to use wet glue, you can use tape. Um I mean I'm not I mean use my scrap paper again. I'm using this green. I didn't even get close to that bottom. Did y'all see that? Now I'm going to just heat emboss this. My favorite one. Again, heat up again. But. I 
to get some tea with. Okay, and then with my Stay Zone ink, my black Stay Zone ink, I think it's called Jet Black. I'm going to stamp Thinking of You on this pink. This is not staying on me. God. Just for some reason. Ah! Isn't where I wanted it, y'all. Okay. I wanted it this one. Okay. You seen how I messed up and just went back and redone it? Okay, I'm going to just chair this. Just like so. And this just gives it a little bit more texture than what it would have. I just left it square. I'm going to stick you right here. I'm just going to put a little bit of glue. I need my glue fall off. And now we have it. A easy peasy embossed card with the frog embossed and the flower embossed and the colored in. I hope y'all like this video. Give us a thumbs up if you like this video. Um, subscribe to the channel. And I will see y'all next time. Y'all have a blessed day. And I'll catch you later.